it's Naomi and today I'm going to do a decor haul. I recently moved so obviously I had to buy a new decor for my room because I finally have my room. Ah! So I got to decorate it how I want to which is really exciting. So I'm going to be doing a room tour in like I think next week or something but I just thought it'd be fun to do a decor, decor haul first. That's hard to say when you have a weird accent. If you enjoyed this, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe and let's just get started. I basically went to three different stores to find like all my decoration, decorations. I'm struggling. Um, so I went to Ross, Target, and Walmart. The old classics. I got this super cute little like candle holder. This is from Ross. I think it was like $6.99, something like that. It's just like kind of a rose goldy kind of geometric shape thing with a candle in. It looks really cute when it's like lit up, and, like the color bounces off the wall. It's real nice. And then I got this wire tray from Walmart. I currently have this on the top of my toilet with like all your toilet necessities, like toilet paper and such in it. And it looks really cute on the top, but it's like super cute anyway that I think you could like use it in your room if you wanted as like room decor so like put stuff in it or you could use it wherever you need it so I'm just using it on the top of my toilet to like jazz up my bathroom. I got the uh, like grey one, they had like a silver one but this is more of like a, I don't know, I'm going for a rustic chic look in my like bathroom and room because I've got kind of a really dark bookcase um, in this kind of colour and then I've got a lampshade that isn't out but it's going to be when I've actually got like a lampshade and I've got the lamp bottom stick I don't know and it's in this kind of like brownie color so this kind of the color um and then I've just got like pops of white like my dressers and the bed and stuff like that so yeah that's kind of the look I was going for but in the bathroom it's like fully gray um except for the bath mat that I'll show you in a second has some white in but so I got that and then I got some towels which I thought I'd show you because they're fun um so well, I mean they're not fun they're just gray but I like the color theme I went for I've got a gray flannel and gray hand towel these are both from Walmart they're nice and soft and then I just have a gray like body towel from Target and they're really nice so I like these and then I've got this little cute clear tray from I'm pretty sure I got it from Walmart it was in like the bathroom section um and I just got it to store my perfume and nail polish on because I had like this really cute blue one but just like wasn't working because it was like too big um and I now I've like decluttered so I literally have nothing on it so now the smaller one looks like so perfect for it so I really like it. I got my bedding as you can see, my sub cute bedding in the background. Um, I have a quilt from Walmart, I got like the quilt set which all the products that I can find will be linked down below so if you want to get any of these for your guys' room if you're redecorating and just want to spruce it up I really recommend because I love everything I got but yeah so the quilt is from Walmart and then I got the palm tree kind of leafy one. Let me grab it. This is what Phil looks like up close. It's really cute. It's just like palm trees or banana leaf ones. I can't, I can't remember what they're called. But it's green and it has like blue things in which is like kind of a pop of colour I've got going on in my room a little bit. So I got this pillow from Target. It was really cute. It was like $10. So I really like that. And then the pink one that I have that's right there. So it's just like a plain pink pillow from Walmart. And I literally like saw it and I was like, oh my gosh, yes. I love that colour of pink. I don't know. It's probably not the cutest. Everybody else in my family thinks it's like a butt color like literally like butt cheeks color but like I like it so yeah I just have them all like that I don't know if it's like cute we weren't like sure when I got it if it all kind of matched or not but I like it now the more it's been there the more I'm like yeah I like it so if you don't like it now just wait a couple of videos of like seeing it in the background and then you're probably like nah, you know what I don't actually hate it because that's literally what happened to me so yeah and then I have a cactus or I guess it's a banana leaf print again I don't know um, just behind my wall, you could see it in shot, but then unfortunately I had to move the shot, so and I can't. But it's fine, it's really cute, I'm going to have shown you like a clip of it on the wall because I'm not going to get it down off the wall. That was like $12. When I went to Target, they had like literally like all of their home decor stuff on clearance. It was amazing. I only was able to find the two things. Is there a big book on my wall? That was strange, it really looked like it was a ginormous like daddy long legs thing on my window. But there was some. It's just like two lines on the window. Okay, same. So the first pen I got was this one from Ross, and it's super duper cute. It was only like eight ninety nine, which is very cheap if you're actually looking at bins. Like, who knew bins were so expensive? Not me. So I got this really cute bin from Ross. This is kind of like, as I was saying, the blue in the pillow. I have like blue in this, and then blue in the 
plant back there, so it kind of all ties in together, I think. Um, but yeah, this is only $8.99 from Ross, and that's like such a bargain when it comes to bins, because bins are so expensive. I did not know how expensive bins were until I had to get one, and they're like super expensive. Like I got one from Walmart, that I'll show you in a sec, and that was like $13.99, and it's not even as cute as this one, but I couldn't find another one, and I really just wanted one then in there so I just like got the one at Walmart that's more expensive but yeah it's so cute it looks like an actual like bin bin you know or a, what is it what do they call, what do Americans call it a trash can a trash can it's like trash can another Ross purchase was my laundry hamper and I love this so much it's kind of like hard to show you but it basically is just wire and it has a like sack bag inside and it has the two hooks and I love it so much it was like I'm pretty sure it was only like eight to twelve dollars i can't remember how much but honestly i'm like literally like having this decoration out like i wanted a fancy one because i wanted it to be like out on display if that makes sense um so you guys might have seen this little sneak peek of it oh 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 in my background right there unless you'll put it back in a sec when she comes back from getting a toast but um yeah so it was there and i really like it because it once again it ties in the whole rustic chic thing that i'm going for and because of the dark wire and match the wire baskets in my bathroom and all of the other darkness that's in the room which is like oh, it's like literally i'm so happy with my room i'm like ah i'm really so happy about it so yes speaking of the expensive bin um this is it it was just from walmart it's nice like i'll give it to it it's nice and then this is the bath mat i got it's super cute it's from walmart as well and it's memory foam so it's like super duper like comfy to get out of the shower and stuff on so i really like that and it goes with the grey theme I got going on. And my last bathroom thing I got was a hand soap. And I wanted to show you this because, like, I think it's a good idea. The first time, um, I just wanted to get, like, a really fancy hand soap thing. So I got a Method, like, Honeycrisp Apple one. So I'd have the bottle. But then me and my family just get, like, the cheapest Walmart soap. Like, we don't really care. Um, and then we just, like, put it in the container. So I thought I'd get a cute one first. And then they always have cute containers in there, so... And then the last thing I have to show you is my plants that I got. Oh, it's so cute. I really wanted some like cactuses or cacti, should I say, and my plants in my room. Um, so I went to Walmart and this is where I got this lovely plant from. Um, I don't know what type it is. It was in the indoor house, like plant section. Um, and then they did have some cacti. Cacti, but um, it was like they were like three dollars each, and they weren't that cute, and there wasn't any like cute parts for them, so I was gonna like DIY some. But I'm like, no, I'm just gonna wait until we get to IKEA, which I think will be like semi in the next like, month or so, I don't know. Um, and then just get them from there instead. So, yeah, at the moment, this is the only plant I've got, but I love it so much. I think it was called like an angel plant or something like that. I felt like there was an angel on the title, but yeah, I just really like it. The pot is actually from Ikea from like years ago, but it went like super cute with my room and stuff, so I thought I'd reuse it. A lot of the decor I had, um, I already had from when we lived here before, we just like put it in storage. So that's why I didn't have to get like that much stuff in a way, like it's still a lot, but I didn't have to get a ton because I already kind of had a lot of like decor stuff and I had a lot of candles that I basically used as decor exhibit a so yeah so that was everything i got i hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe and if you like anything and as i said if you want to check anything out it's all linked down below and yeah thanks for watching i'll see you guys in a couple of days bye